team of the night. Everyone put your hands together for the wonderful, the vibrant, the vivacious, the uh, cinematically exuberant Zazzle! Mr. Don A. King. My name is Patrick. It's nice to meet you. You as well. Um, so we're going to improvise, but for us to, to improvise, we're going to I'm going to ask you some question. If you could just tell like a maybe a brief little story based off of some of your experiences in the film world, because you are in the film world. What do you what do you work in the film world as? Generally, my niche is uh, old white racist guy. Okay. <laughs> is this is this a position on most film sets or? Well, uh, let's see. I play a southern congressman. I played a southern senator. I played a old white rich guy. Okay. I play a priest. Okay. You what you may. So, um, yeah, as an actor, as yeah. an actor. So normally right. you are an actor on film sets. What's what's one of your most uh, recent projects that you've done? Um, this week, um, March 15th, the show Manhunt on Apple, uh, where I play a Southern congressman from Georgia. All right. What's, what's Manhunt about? Uh, it's based on a bestseller um, of the same name, Manhunt, and it's the hunt for John Wilkes Booth, uh, Tobias Menzies, Lily Taylor, um, Don King, um, <laughs> with many a fine cast, and it's... Um, it's a great conspiracy, even though it's history and we know what happens. Yeah, there's a lot of intrigue. So, so what are some other projects that you've been in? You've been a priest, you've been a southern racist guy, a southern racist guy, a southern racist guy, and a different southern racist guy. Well, I, lo I worked on a show for about four weeks called Lovecraft Country. Okay. Um, again, uh, playing an old, old white racist guy. <laughs> uh, the interesting thing about that, and it was great because it was produced by Jordan Peele. One of my favorite comedians among everyone else that I've watched tonight. Um, and anyway, the thing about it that was interesting is I would go to my hair and makeup every day, and then they would put a black mask over my face and a robe. And I worked with Tony Goldwyn and quite a lot of other people, but I worked on this show for, like I said, almost four weeks, and you absolutely have no idea who I am but probably made the most money I've ever made on any yeah. particular project. I do know who I am because at one point I get disintegrated. So, so is that uh, your favorite story? Do you have any favorite stories from your time working uh, as an actor on, in film? I think probably the favorite time I had was working on a show called Shots Fired. I worked with Richard Dreyfuss and I was kind of cast as his double a little bit, but um, I was the one who was thought to uh, kill this person, and I worked with Helen Hunt. I worked with uh, one of my favorite character actors, Will Patton, um, and it was an awesome experience, one of the best times I've had on set. So, yeah. Is there a day um, on set that like really stood out to you, that like really solidified shots fired as like the one that you go back to when someone on stage asks you this question? Mm -hmm. Particularly the, the big scene that got cut. Um, I was working with Will Patton. We were at a shooting indoor shooting range. And as we were shooting the scene, my gun would fire once, and it was blanks, and I was supposed to continue shooting. And Will is over here just bam, 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 and I'm going bam, and then like. <laughs> and the hopes they can always fix it in post. And as we all know as filmmakers, 
we can fix it in post. So, um, and no. But anyway, yeah. Um, but yeah, that was my fun day, I guess. Perfect. So, yeah. Cool. Can I ask him? Yeah. Okay, so I'm really intrigued. You said that your character was disintegrated. Uh, are there any other ways that any of your characters have been killed that were interesting? <laughs> uh. um, that was probably the only time I've actually been killed. That's a good way to go. Yeah. Okay, so. it, was, it was fun because I went into this booth, and again, with all the thing about AI, um, I was in a eight by eight booth, 180 Canon cameras surrounding me, and blink, 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 and suddenly I'm now in their memory bank. So yeah, um, but yeah, that's how I know who I am in that show. So yeah, cool. Thank you very much. something beautiful oh. within our play. <laughs> it's a wonderful evening at the theater. I'd say thank you for taking me out. Oh, it gets so lonely. Of course, Sarah. <laughs> Would you like to use um, my theater Binoculars, binoculars yes. yes. I'm still getting used to this new technology. <laughs> oh, Peggy Hamilton. Oh. I don't want to talk to her. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Look at the feather in her hat. That's obscene. Where did you get a bird that big? I think she probably got it from the new continent. <laughs> yes. Africa. I believe, yes. <laughs> How are the children? They miss you. <laughs> You're growing up so well. Yeah. The war should be over by spring. <laughs> of course, what could go wrong? <laughs> you jest. Indeed. <laughs> Abraham, we miss you at home. I, I dare I say it, I, but I did. I, I know, but my responsibilities are so great at the factory and... <laughs> Indeed, the factory. We need the munitions so we can win. <laughs> Well, then I see a once time I find you guys win. I was supposed to say, I don't know. <laughs> Watch out! Whoa! Hold on! Chill out! They don't know anything about life without technology. I like the old way best. Yeah, when you had to pull out a map and you, you knew how to read it. Pull out a map. Latitude, longitude. Your compass, the stars. The, you did that. The, the, the this, thing, this the, thing. The, the, oh, which way does the wind go? Hold on! Did a picture of you. You did. Yes. The two of us when we were together. Don't oh. cry. I just, I just had almost lost hope. 
I'm back. I'm not letting go anytime soon. Well, I had to see you factory. <laughs> so, these are some of the newest cannon fodder we have. Oh, wonderful. Exploding shells. Wow, I, I, the shells that didn't explode were so boring. <laughs> this is cutting edge tennis. Cutting edge stuff. Indeed. My uh, children would love seeing it. <laughs> They could indeed see it. They're right outside the door, as a matter of fact. <laughs> You've broke them. I did! Abraham. Yeah. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> huh. You have to want it. <laughs> of course I want to see my children. I... I dream about them, but I haven't seen them since they were yay tall. Will they remember me? No, they won't. I didn't have a beard before. Hey, 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 check it out. Hey, check it out. I got some firecrackers. Oh, hey, firecrackers. I've got some sparklers. <laughs> I brought a cold brew. Dad, it's no fun when you don't, when you don't do what we're doing. I think it's good. Set things on fire. I set things on fire. Just one cold brew. Oh, I'll have but, some caffeine. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> no, that's serious. I'm excited that you want to try the caffeine. <laughs> Drink it. I want to try caffeine. See how your sister reacts to it first. All right! She's fine. And then we can set off firecrackers. Yeah. Sister, why don't you light your sparkler with my sparkler's light? <laughs> Did you already light your sparkler? Yes, it's sparkling in your face. Fire and caffeine. Fire and caffeine. We're gonna be just fine without mother. We yeah. need her at all. I mean, I'm upset about it. It's okay if you guys are upset about it. We can take our time. We're not upset at all. I bought you a bunch of, I bought a new nitro cold brew machine, and you guys, I got a bunch of sparklers and firecrackers for you. I'm hurt. I'm going to be honest. I'm, 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 I'm. So I know you guys said it's all going to be added in post, but the reason I got into porno was to be a porno actor. I, just, that's what I can't about. get it hard. I don't know. is a much better penis than either penis that you guys got. Now, uh, listen, I've seen a lot of penises in my days, and AI penis, the best penis you ever had, okay? Rich, I can get it going. Come now, on, listen, man, minutes. that thing's hanging too far to the left, ah, too far to the right, and AI penis it's is exactly I'm right in the Are you fucking talking back to me? The amount of penises I've seen, okay? He's not talking back to you, Rich, but we got so many penises here, we can do so many things. Why do you got two penis? I got. I can't. I, I gotta fix that in post. I gotta give you three. You said you had three penis. The annual Saladin Croquet Tournament is almost ready. Oh! Whoa. I hear people warming up as we speak. Oh, you have to get your plaid on. Oh, oh I didn't bring. I'm that. serious. So checkers. This oh, time. we need plaid. I didn't bring the plaid. Oh, I'm coming through. 
am the god of the sea, and you have found yourselves at the depths of me. I know I am time for wishes three. Take your time and slow down. You'll see. Sorry, we just need you for dinner. With you. I'm working on my tight five with this dead ship captain. I don't want to come have dinner with the nymphs. I'm sorry. They always talk about the same things. We miss you. I miss you. I, I I don't miss you. I don't want to lie to you. I'm so sorry. I want to be irresistible. Oh, God. <laughs> sorry. I missed your game. It's okay. I, I brought you some cake. You didn't have to do that. Well, I wanted you to love me, so I thought I had to do something. Of course I love you, Gertrude. <laughs> well, you know, your actions speak louder than words. Well, I'm the security guard. Papa! Yes, son. I brought you a, a, a football helmet full of Krispy Kreme donuts. <laughs> I wanted you to love me. I do love you, son. Papa, I brought you those photographs of mommy that you wanted. <laughs> Thank you. She was walking out of the room. She is this. cheating on me. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 You're my favorite son, my smart son. Thank you. <laughs> Well, that's the last of it. It's all the cocaine we have left. <laughs> Cut right through that box. <laughs> I won't get to the cocaine. It's a sharp fucking knife. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Yeah, that's okay. If it gets all over the floor, it gets all over the floor. We're gonna do it regardless, you know? Hey, uh, hey. gotta go capture the Titanic, but I needed to get a little fix first. Yeah, go ahead. Here, let me just... Sure, would you like some for the voyage? Yeah, I think I'm gonna... You know what, I'll take the... You don't even break it off. I'll take the whole thing. Whoa! I got a lot of crew. Yeah, all right. <laughs> what could go wrong? Yeah, classic <laughs> night. <laughs> 1917 cocaine deal. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Fine. Thank you for showing up, April. Of course, it was wonderful seeing the children a few weeks ago. <laughs> Through a window. <laughs> But as you were passing by, I hadn't seen them in years. And they said, who's that man? <laughs> said a homeless man. Sarah! Abraham! Why? Why? You know why. Abraham, you indignant scoundrel. She sings like an angel. I must know who she is. <laughs> Peggy Hamilton? <laughs> The new star of the play? Yes, wow, what a voice. What breasts. <laughs> I can't find my glasses. I can't find my teeth. I can't find my kids. <laughs> Are you having trouble finding stuff? <laughs> Well, this keychain you can put on important things and you won't lose your stuff that's important. I lost my kid on purpose. <laughs> I didn't want them anymore. <laughs> hey, oh, hey, I just want to talk to you about some of the actors that you're hiring for your commercials. Yeah, I try to, some of them are a bit serious. Yeah. Yeah. That guy, he's actually wanted by the FBI. <laughs> His performance is so real. I know. Her penis is hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here for my money. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, this is the head of the company. Hi, uh, nice to meet you. Niles. Uh, oh. I, I didn't get paid for my eight hours, and you took too long to feed me. Oh. My 
dietary restrictions are very clear. I sent them to your AD. You thought I was difficult? He's a very serious actor. He has over 50 IMDb credits. I was featured background in everything. <laughs> it's so scary and dark out here. Oh, shit. I hate nature. That sounds like a bird. You know what? Oh, what the fuck was that? That doesn't usually happen. That's what you just said! I know, I was telling them. <laughs> Do you suffer from erectile dysfunction? <laughs> well, this keychain. Poseidon, it's for waiting for you. Yes, good. <laughs> we have so much flounder prepared for you. Oh, I've had so much flounder. Oh, I just want to hang out with dead sea captains. <laughs> All these ethereal beings of the ocean, they don't interest me anymore. I'm really having a middle age fucking time. <laughs> I mean, am I alone here, Nymphs? Don't we all miss Poseidon? Miss him! Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, this is fun and festive and frivolous and playful, but like, where's the death? Yeah. Oh. All those old sea captains who are dead have so much, like, yearning. Yearning? We think have yearning? Want You're so much, baby. so deeply. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not in control anymore. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! There's a there's a boat. It's about to hit us. The iceberg. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. Hey, do you guys want to like hang out? Oh, we can go. Oh God, we're not gonna make it. Oh. I miss you guys so much. Oh. Cockney British accents I've ever heard. That's yeah. right up there with Johnny Depp. There you go. 